I'm gonna make a lot of you guys really happy today. Finally, the sweet potato galette recipe. Come on, let's get right into it. There's a lot happening here. Okay, I've sliced my potatoes on this mandolin right here. That's what I've used. If you don't have one, don't worry. Just use a knife and make sure it's nice and thin. Follow along here, there's a few steps. All I'm doing is I'm taking the sweet potatoes and I'm just layering it all on the bottom of the casserole, just like this. It's not that hard to do. Okay, once that's done, I'm sprinkling a little bit of the shallots. The shallots are actually a French onion, it's a little bit milder. I've got some Gruyere cheese here also going in with that. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. Okay, now we're just taking whipping cream. I've heated this whipping cream up with a half a teaspoon. It's two cups of whipping cream, half a teaspoon of nutmeg. I'm repeating my layers now. Just follow along here. It's not that hard. Just layer by layer. Now I've done this really thin, the potatoes. The secret to this dish is to get your potatoes as thin as possible. The reason for that is it's going to, the multi layers and the whipped cream, it just cooks right through and you get a nice cake effect. If you can make this dish in particular the day before, go ahead and do it. If it sits a day, it's way better, but for sure you're going to have to make it sit for at least 15 minutes. We're doing another salt and pepper layer on here. Another layer going in. Now you can make as many layers. The more layers, of course, the prettier it's going to be. Uh, there's no rhyme or reason to this. It doesn't have to be uniformed. It just has to have layers. One more like that. We're going to almost be there, I think. We're going to put some more cheese on here and onion. And again, use your, um, for sure, the shallots on this one. Don't use a regular onion. The shallots are much milder, a nicer flavor to go with this. Uh, I am also using the Gruyere cheese. My choice. That's what I've always used. That's what you guys love. You don't have to. You can use whatever cheese you want. Final layer going on right here. We're going to put some of the whipping cream. Just evenly all the way across. Then we're going to put one more layer of potato and we're going to finish it off with the cheese. Not hard at all. Take a look here. Now this is going to feed eight people, this particular casserole. As I said, we're finishing off with the cheese. This is going in the oven. It's going to go in a 350 degree oven. It's going to go in for 45 minutes. Make sure you cover it, okay? After 45 minutes, take the cover off in for another 15 minutes. Guess what you're going to get? Take a good look here. Ah, that's hot. Okay, take a good look. This is the sweet potato galette that you guys have been asking for. Haven't made it for you guys in a while, but now you can make it yourself. Put your hand to it, it's not hard. And you know what, go to my recipes, uh, www.youneverknow.com. It's gonna be sitting there waiting for you.